Hey, what's up, guys? He and Bridget here on your weekly home tour. We're going to check out this one in Poway. Poway Ranch Bernardo, right on the line. Um, four bedrooms, three baths, a little over. How many square feet? It's almost 2,200 square feet. Yeah, big front lawn, what it looks like. Um, so let's go check it out, see if the picture's the same as it is in real life. So it is kind of on a main street, but still really nice. Look at that. Parks behind me. Oh, there's B. Oh, nice. Peeks into what was this I living room? As with most of these flips, they usually don't come with refrigerators. So, note to self if you want a flipped home, you're gonna have to buy appliances normally. Oh, yeah, it's a nice little setup for like a TV room. Kitchen's up, up there. Got here. Oh, that's nice. Very open. Look at this. And you got X. You got a little vantage point from the top of the stairs. What's this over here? Bathroom? Or excuse me. Yeah. Sorry. Can't figure out the light, but the floors are epoxy. Nice. Is this the bathroom? Oh my gosh. Oh, man, it's terrible. Yeah. Look at all the fun. One. Nice remote. First guest bedroom. Next to the backyard. Look at that little guest bedroom office. Little patio area. Oh, here's the little vantage point downstairs. Here's the primary room. Oh, look at that. All the space on this side. A little balcony. Oh, One cool thing I really like about this property is that there's no backyard neighbors. Like, it's just, just a neighborhood. I'll show you on the drone. No, it's just a neighbor. Here's the primary bathroom. Nice. Dual vanities. Nice, hello the camera. Another closet, so two closets. Mm -hmm. Outdoor, it's over here to the right. More bedrooms, oh yeah, there's two more. Ah, closet. Nice, all bathrooms match, that's cool. There we go. Decent size. I will say though, these windows are awesome, but terrible to replace. A couple of these things. Jeez, mess with it. But huge. Anything outside the standard square, dual pane, crazy expensive. Here's another one. Closet space. Room. Really good for the walk. I think they all do. They all have walks. Guess in case you want to rent these things out. Pretty cool. It's on to the backyard. Oh, backyard. Ooh. Very zen. This is like the ultimate putting green. I can't 
can't, can't see if you tell, but the backyard slopes. This is kind of cool. You could literally build like the best, like putt putt. We're gonna nickname this home the putt putt yard because if you wanted to change any of that into a putt putt green, this is the house for you. So, what do you think about the putt putt house? I actually really like it. I like the layout. It's, it's nice. Everything about the home itself is very nice. I think the only downside is being on a busier street. And then, if you don't want to be directly across the street from the park. Yeah, I kind of like it though. If you have kids or anything like that, you can have them go play across the park. Just make sure you walk across the street. Well, that's what I'm saying. The, the park is nice. Yeah. It's not what you're looking for if you're a family. And the house, I mean, the layout's big, right? No, this is definitely a family home. Yeah. So the location being across from the park is good. Just saying these are things I wanted to point out. Yeah. I personally like the putt-putt backyard. I think I could make that a, a bachelor's best friend dream home that's air imagine except air it's a family home so it would be kids little, putt -putt. yes imagine kids rolling down that hill <laughs> this is fun. not a bachelor pad <laughs> okay maybe not a bachelor pad but the most amazing airbnb known to mankind but i like it that would I, be good. I like the fact that the park's right across the street um it sucks it is on kind of a busy busy street even with because it's, it's I, I would say busier street it's yeah. not a main street it's yeah. just a busier street you're at the entrance yeah. of the neighborhood yeah that's true um but you're set uh, in defense of this home you're set pretty far back from the street if you look at that front yard my walk up like it's it's a good distance yeah. back where some of the other homes are kind of close to the street yeah. so you have distance and we're sitting inside the house right now and you can't hear any of the no cars. it's definitely very quiet even the park has a decent amount of you know kids over there playing and whatnot but you can't hear them no yeah but and think about too the age group, and then it's right next to like that neighborhood right across the way, the Vienna or whatever. Was no, the neighborhood's very nice. Yeah. I just, like I said, pointing out the things that you're not necessarily gonna know. Yeah, another thing, reminder. I said earlier, but whenever you buy these flips, a lot of times you have to buy refrigerators for whatever reason. It's not part of their business plan. Um, but or you can always just get a credit for it. Also true. <laughs> So, Depending on the situation, but with this one, I think you could. Yeah, me too. It's been on the market 30 days. Forgot, so once again, this is what $1.3 million gets you in Poway. Um, like, subscribe to the video if you want to see more videos, just like it. Please write comments. We read each and every one of them and we'll respond. Um, see you next video.